Hello grade 1 amazing learners and inquirers. Welcome to a new video that is related to our UOI classes. In this video, we're going to explain the concepts that we are going to study about in our social studies or UOI classes. In this video, we're going to learn about the reason why we have rules and rules in different places around our communities. What rules can you think of? If I ask you to mention some examples of rules that you already know, we can mention that we need to wash our hands before eating, drive on the left hand side of the road, stop at red traffic lights, throw rubbish in the bin, we never throw garbage uh, uh, on the floor when we are in the class, at home, in the street, in the school, anywhere. We always need to find a trash bin and throw the garbage in. Look before you cross the road. This is one of the very important street rules that we are going to discuss also. Keep your hands to yourself, of course. We always use our hands to what is good. We don't use our hands to something bad like fighting or hitting our friends, right? What places have rules? We all know that there are many places in our community and all of these places have rules that we need to stick to when we go to these places. Like when we go to the clubs, team sports, communities, groups, places of work, swimming pools, roads, and the seaside or the beach. But why are rules important? Let's discuss that. Number one, the rules are very important to keep people safe. Number two, to help people learn. If we want to learn, we need to follow the rules. For example, the classroom rules so we are able to learn from our teacher. Number three, to help us understand the difference between right and wrong. When we have rules, we always know what is right and what is wrong. Number four, to give everyone a chance to join in. Imagine our classroom is without rules and everyone is talking together. Will it be a good chance for everyone to join our conversation and to listen carefully and to learn from the teacher? Of course no. To help us show respect for each other. When we follow the rules, we respect each other. And to give everyone a chance to be heard. When we take turns in the classroom, we hear all of our friends and their discussions, right? So it gives us the, the chance to have, to, to be, to, to say whatever we want to say and for others to listen to us. If we didn't have rules and everyone could do whatever they wanted, there would be chaos, of course. It's gonna be messy. Who makes the rules? The rules can be made by our parents, our teachers, us. We also can agree on our own rules because we are responsible enough to know the rules and to know how to follow them. Organizations also have always rules and the government, of course. Now let's discuss rules around us. Let's discuss some rules that we can follow in different places around our community. Play area rules. There are always rules when we go to the playground, of, for example, or to the garden in our neighborhood to play with our friends. We always have to take care, take turns. We have to share. We have to clean up after we are done playing. And we have to always play safely. There are also school rules, right? We always need to follow the rules in our school. We need to recycle our garbage. We never hit our friends in the playground or when we are playing. We always listen to our teachers and be responsible excellent we have to be also risk takers and do the initiatives to clean up our classroom 
to clean up our um, uh, to clean up our books after we are done to take them back to our copies to always keep responsibility of our stuff like our jackets our um, uh, water bottles our pencil cases and our belongings we always have to take care of them and put them back in their suitable places excellent there are also rules at the beach we always to need to need to follow these rules we never go to the beach or to the pool alone without our parents we always need our floaters or life jackets excellent we always have to drink water while we are on the beach or on the sh on the uh, um, shore right we always have to drink water to protect us from the sun we need to use a sun protector excellent or a sunscreen always to protect our skin from the sun we never go far away while we are swimming in the sea for example we always make sure that we that our parents are close to us we can see them and they can see us safety in the mall we always have to take care in these places because these places are very big and spacious we always have to stick to our parents we never leave them and go far away from them we never listen to strangers or go with them when they talk to us and this are these are safety rules that we are going to elaborate more about in our protect at classes or young well classes in our school these rules everywhere as we said Now, after we're done discussing all the rules in every place in our community and the places in our community and the community helpers in our community, we're going to have our class project also this during this week. We are going to build our own community, which each one of us will build a building, a fire station, a hospital, a house, a school. Um, a, um, a fire a fire station a police uh, office and we will all put them all together to create our own community it's going to be a very interesting activity after that we are going to, to read the informational text look both ways it's going to tell us about the street rules that we need to follow when we are in the street whether we are walking or driving it's a very interesting text and it's it's full of information because of course it's an informational text we are going to read it through our english book in our uoi classes so this is a summary of what we are going to do in in this week in our uoi classes at the end of my video i want to say that i love you all and thank you for listening